Now in this guide, let's take a look at how we can change the navigation gestures on iPhone and let's get us started. So at first, you should know that there are these built-in gestures, of course, like returning back from the open apps by swiping up from the bottom or returning back to the previous page, you know, by swiping left, right? So this is like the basic gesture methods. But if you want to change the way you operate and use your phone, like these gestures, right? You can go ahead and do that with the use of what's called assistive touch. So this is like a floating menu, which is always with you. And you can perform some things like instead of swiping up to get it to the home screen, you can click the home button, right? Which is like a virtual one. So in order to set this up, obviously you can customize it as much as you want, but in order to make it work, you have to find the settings app of your iPhone, get inside and locate the accessibility section. Part of the accessibility should be the touch section right there. So get inside of the menu and literally the first thing is the assistive touch. So ensure that the green toggle is there, meaning it is turned on and then we can begin with the customizing. So we can customize the single tab, double tab and a long press, right? So I like to keep it set that the single tab opens up this menu and I can customize the menu as much as I like. So I can choose that, for example, I have quick access to the camera or, you know, whatever else I prefer. I can even add some other like buttons in here. I think the max is like eight. So yeah, you can just tweak that, customize it as much as you like. And you can see that I can get to the app switcher without using the gestures. So it gets the job done if this is what you are going after, right? So it might be useful for a lot of people. Let me know below in the comments what you think about it. And if you had something else in mind, go ahead and let me know about that. Chances are I'll make an updated video about it. So thanks a lot. Subscribe for more and I'll catch you later in other future videos.